basics about the harmonica. Take your harmonica out, and you'll see numbers on one edge of the harmonica. But the numbers go on the top, and what that does is it puts the, the low notes on the left, and it puts the high notes on the right. Today I introduced the harmonica to the pulmonary transplant patients and their caregivers. Um, introduce the harmonica and the benefits the harmonica can bring to them. Then when you open it, you get a different sound. The magic of the harmonica is that it, it uh, not only helps physically because of what it's doing actively for your lungs, but it, it also helps emotionally it, it, because it, it is music, it is a pleasant sound. One, two, three, four. I absolutely think there is a place in hospitals for uh, humanities and art in medicine. Any art activity for any patient is a worthwhile thing because it gets them outside of themselves, outside of their worries and anxieties, and, and, and gets them to focus on something that's pleasant. When you're playing a song, playing a tune, because of the way the harmonica is laid out and the way the song takes you, you might have to keep inhaling longer than you'd really like to. And likewise, you might be exhaling longer than you might really want to. But for the sake of the song, you'll do it. I know firsthand the benefits of harmonica playing to a pulmonary transplant patient because I myself am a two-time pulmonary transplant patient. I was not playing the harmonica yet after the first transplant. I was playing the harmonica at the time of the second transplant and since. And so I've been able to make a comparison of what life after pulmonary transplant was like without the harmonica and with the harmonica. And there's no doubt in my mind which is the better of the two. To see people realize how good music makes them feel as, as patients is so gratifying to me. I'm, I'm like a, a missionary for all the good that music can provide. And, and to see non-musicians realize what music can do for them too is just so gratifying and uh, I think that's something the Mayo Clinic gets actually I think that's what humanities and medicine is all about they do get it that's why it exists you know that one? Thanks.